welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be winning Space Rockies. So, hope you enjoy. Barry was Olsen's dog, and Olsen was Barry's boy. Every day, Barry worked to sniff out new adventures. Adventures like sweeping of mom's best sheets, helping himself to Olsen's dinner, or even cheering on dad's slippers. Barry's adventures always got him into trouble. Barry's favorite adventures was exploring the neighbor's gardens. He particularly liked the garden at number 12, the one that belonged to a famous astronaut. One day, a gigantic space rocket was parked on astronaut's lawn. Nosy Barry couldn't help but scamper inside to play. He sniffed at buttons and bounced happily around the control deck. Bounce! 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 Then, he accidentally sat on a big red button marked ignition. The engine swirled into action. Blasting the Watkins into space. Barry thought that Olsen would be mad at him, but he was having too much fun to worry. He didn't know how to fly a rocket, but luckily it was programmed to land on the moon. And so it did with a thump. Before you could shout, Here, boy, Barry was in the space suit and zooming off in search of adventure. Minutes later, Barry came shinning back from the other side of the moon. He'd found some new friends to play with. Shiny robot pooches and their equally shiny owner. You're a long way from home, aren't you, boy? Beeped the robot owner. Barry whined sadly at the thought of home. Olsen would normally be walking him in the park about now. He missed him terribly. Don't be sad, said the robot. I know what will cheer you up. To Barry's amazement, the robot unscrewed one of his arms and hurled it past with his other arm. Fetch, boy, he shouted, unable to resist fetching the stick arm. Barry chased after it as it hurtled full space towards Earth. Faster and faster went Barry, tumbling towards Earth at an incredible speed. He eventually caught hold of the stick arm and shut his eyes as he prepared. Roof winding, crash landing. When he opened his eyes, however, he was tucked up in his basket with Olsen at his side. Oh, never run away again, he thought, looking up at his friend. Barry had dreamt the whole thing. He would be much happier with normal walkers from now on. After all, dogs can't really go on space walkies, can they? This is the end. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.